34 and we're following a developing story this morning out of College Park. Now one man is dead after an overnight hit and run on Route 1 at Knox Road. Our John Gonzalez is live there with the very latest and some sad news right here before they get ready to go back to school, John. That's right. During winter break, and like you said, Autry, as they get ready to come back to school, a student has been killed here on Route 1. And once some of the businesses here this morning open up, police will be coming door to door trying to find some surveillance video that may have captured this hit and run, and also hoping to talk to witnesses because they believe that someone had to have seen this car. In fact, they believe the victim was walking with someone at the time of this incident. Now, I'm going to step out of the way and show you this is where this happened, right near the intersection of Knox Road and Baltimore Avenue you shortly after two o'clock this morning and police have confirmed to us this morning the victim was indeed a student here at the University of Maryland and part of the investigation including included collecting evidence for hours including the young man's bloodied clothing that was strewn across the roadway and his tennis shoes and at this hour police are looking for a dark blue metallic sedan with extensive damage to the front and passenger side the student was struck trying to cross the southbound lanes here on Baltimore Avenue Route 1. He was not at a crosswalk, police say, but the driver of that vehicle never stopped, never even slowed down. That's according to a Prince George's County police spokesperson. After the collision, reconstruction unit was out here trying to piece this all together for several hours this morning. Route 1 has reopened in both directions, but of course, this investigation and the search for the driver continues. Reporting live in College Park, John Gonzalez, ABC 7 News.